Even though the nursing shortage is a national problem, things might be looking up. Projections by the Bureau of Labor Statistics expect that workforce to grow by 6% by 2031. 23 News reporter Connor Hollingsworth speaks with the new president of OSF St. Anthony College of Nursing in Rockford about her plans to raise that number locally. <laughs> I'm very excited. Uh, I like a challenge. Um, I'm working on building the enrollment up. I've got some ideas. Uh, to do that. Dr. Charlene Aaron most recently served as Chancellor of St. John's College of Nursing in Springfield, where she helped streamline a program to help licensed practical nurses get a Bachelor of Science degree in nursing. It's proven to be quite popular and it has helped increase the enrollment at my former college. She also wants to lure more men into the nursing field. I just like helping people. My grandma had a laundry list of health issues when I was growing up and I was around nurses my whole life so I saw the difference that they can make. There was nothing in particular, it was just being able to make a difference. Josh Roth is a senior at OSF St. Anthony College of Nursing in Rockford. He says he's only one of six men in his class of 40. Nursing in particular is advertised as a female profession but uh, I think if you advertise it more and get more men into the program just to start uh, will definitely help. Both Josh and Dr. Aaron want to help alleviate some of the stereotypes that surround nursing, helping people realize that nursing isn't just a profession for women and help them understand that it's a science that compares to other STEM careers. We need to be including nursing in the field of STEM education because it really is a science. Nursing is an art and a science. Even as a student, I've been able to touch so many lives, I feel like, and it just gives me the best feeling in the world. Working for you in Rockford, Connor Hollingsworth, 23 News. Dr. Aaron would also like to see more men act as mentors to attract more workers to the industry.